Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Elder Scrolls Online, and happy 10th anniversary. So we are going to do the Jubilee Quest, which I understand it has some new stuff in the scroll around. Um, I don't think I have... There's a fade. I don't th think I have the Jubilee Quest. Oh, just see. Okay. All right, where, where am I going? <laughs> where am I going? Um, I have no idea where I'm going. I think it's over here. Could be wrong. Not entirely sure. Honestly speaking. Okay. Comrade, a word. Nope. Danalon's apprentice is no true baker. This will ruin Chef Donalon for sure. Those sneaky, envious, sorry excuses for bakers. Father warned me to be wary, but for them to swarm like vultures right after he said sail? Oh, sorry. It's just that my father is counting on me and... Everything has gone wrong. Hunting on you for what? To prepare our renowned Jubilee cakes for the new season, of course. Apologies. I'm Moog, apprentice to my father, the patron of pies himself, Chef Donalon. But thanks to those vultures, there may not be any cakes this time around. What did those bakers, other bakers do? Ever since father began his journey of culinary exploration, his rivals have made things difficult. They spread lies, even stole my ingredients. Could you help? Fling pies to embarrass them and recover the ingredients for the Jubilee cake? I can fling some pies and recover the, your ingredients. Take these flinging pies and throw them at Chef Ziram and Chef Banel. That will teach them. Then grab the ingredients they stole. My father's special flour blend and my mix of essential sugars. I'll reward you well for helping me, Traveler. Seeing how this is a Khajiit, I can, uh, sugars and cats and, and, and Khajiits don't mix well. If you know the lore of Khajiits and, and, and sugars. Uh, how long have you been Chef Donalon's apprentice? Oh, ever since I was this high to a cane stalk and he encountered me alone in the moon sugar fields. He was collecting stalks when he found me. He said I was a sweet surprise. I was just a cub, but it was the best day of my life. Why was that? Because father, uh, Chef Donalon, gave me purpose. 
I was an orphan, on my own, trying to survive and failing terribly when he found me. I helped him finish gathering stocks and became his apprentice from that moment on. And did Chef Donalon adopt you after that? After our first meeting? Oh, no. <laughs> but the taste of that sweet roll he made me was a revelation. I helped him with all sorts of small tasks until he handed me a whisk and asked if I wanted to be his son. I can't fail him now. I just can't. Tell me more about Chef Donalon's culinary journey. He called it a journey of culinary discovery. He's sailing to ports across Tamriel to sample the regional cuisine. He plans to bring back new recipes to make our cakes and pies even better. He left me here to prepare this season's Jubilee cake. That sounds like quite an honor. Oh, it most definitely is. A singular honor and also a test of my skill as a baker. I'll need to use everything Father ever taught me to replicate his renowned recipe. And I plan to make a couple of adjustments to make this version my own. Have you ever, have you made a Jubilee cake, Jubilee cake before? Of course, but always while assisting my father. This is the first time Chef Donalon has allowed me to try such a complicated recipe on my own. It shows he trusts me and thinks I'm ready. I hope I don't prove him wrong. Nice. Have at thee. Uh, you want a pie at me? I hate pie. Well. All right. Do I taste gore apple? Gore apple gives me hives. <laughs> <laughs> oh, funny. Can't you see I'm busy? You? Your skill at pie throwing is quite excellent. Excellent, my friend. And it was only a matter of time before those so-called bakers' false claims came back to hit them in the face. Uh, were you also able to recover my sugar and father's flour blend? Yes, here are your ingredients. You, my friend, are a miracle worker. Now that I have my missing ingredients back, and my father's annoying rivals have run off, I can finally start baking. You're going to make the Jubilee cake now? But of course, this is the moment I've trained for, the moment I've dreamed of. And as an additional thanks for aiding me, you not only get to witness the splendor of its creation, you get to taste the first slice. Now, let me work. Okay. Add the sugar and flour, 12 eggs. And it fades to black. Whisk three times, no more, no less. Just like father. Out of the oven and... Perfect! All it needed was to fling some pies and meet you, my friend. Behold, this season's Jubilee cake! Decadent and delicious, as only a true Chef Donalon recipe can be. Hopefully I have done my father proud and showcased all the skills he taught me. In fact, he inspired my version of his ultimate creation. Tell me about your inspiration. Chef Donalon has spent his life trying to unite Tamriel through delicious desserts. My Jubilee cake represents his passions and efforts. Qualities he has passed down to me. Now please, accept this with my thanks, friend. And try a piece of cake. That's what the Jubilee cake looks like. It's basically the white gold tower, basically. That's what it basically is. Yeah. Baron Von Eva. <laughs> what a name. Arika Ree. Eerie, whatever. Nice. Oh. 
But yeah, it's basically the White Gold Tower. That's what it basically is. Or it could be the Adamantine Tower. By the way, pretty cool. Pretty darn cool, if I do say so myself. What is it? Jubilee cake. Nice. Anyways, guys, hope you all enjoyed this little short little episode. But yeah, that's basically what the Jubilee Cake is, uh, or, or Jubilee Festival is. It's basically a year round, um, um, a yearly thing that happens once a year, um, and uh, overall just a way to celebrate ESO's e ESO's lifespan uh, for lasting this long, and uh, its fan base. So anyways, uh, I hope you all enjoyed this episode, guys. Make sure to leave a like, comment your thoughts down below, and uh, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more content like this. I also, well, not like this, but, you know, like, similar to this. I also am doing uh, a lot of Let's Plays on this channel. I'm also doing, um, I'm currently doing a Legendary uh, Difficulty Skyrim playthrough. Um, I'm doing an Oblivion playthrough, which is a lot of fun. Um, yeah, so... Pretty much it, uh, and uh, yeah, so I'll catch y'all later, guys. Bye.